Football has evolved over the years, but there's one player who seems to have been left behind David De Gea. The Manchester United goalkeeper is facing questions about whether he should be the long-term option for the club to become title contenders again. Just look at what happened with Joe Hart at Manchester City. Pep Guardiola wasted no time in replacing Hart, despite him being England's first-choice goalkeeper. Guardiola wanted a goalkeeper who could start moves with his feet, so he brought in Claudio Bravo and then Ederson Marais. And it's not just City, Chelsea, and Liverpool, the other title winners in the Guardiola era also had goalkeepers who could play with their feet. But De Gea's weaknesses were exposed in a recent match against Sevilla. He made costly mistakes with the ball at his feet, leading to two goals for the opposition. It's clear that goalkeeping has evolved, and De Gea hasn't kept pace with his rivals at other clubs. De Gea has been at Manchester United for 12 years and has been a great shot stopper, but the game has changed. His contract situation is also uncertain, with his current deal set to expire at the end of the season. United have hesitated to trigger his one-year extension option due to his high wages. There is a lower salary contract on the table for him to sign with incentives based on games played. Both De Gea and the club are in a complicated situation regarding his future. He has been allowed to speak to other clubs over a pre-contract, but there are no slots for goalkeepers at the top European teams. Tottenham is looking for a long-term replacement for Hugo Lloris, but they wouldn't meet De Gea's wage expectations. United themselves want to spend in the summer, but their main priorities are a midfielder and a striker. Eric Ten Hag, the manager of Manchester United, has praised De Gea in the past, but it's clear that goalkeeping has evolved and De Gea hasn't kept up. He needs competition and support. The blame shouldn't solely be on him for his recent mistakes. The defense also needs to be fit for purpose. So, the question remains, should De Gea be the long-term goalkeeper for Manchester United? It's clear that the game has changed, and the club needs a goalkeeper who can play with their feet and contribute to the team's overall style of play. De Gea has been a great servant to the club, but it may be time for a new era in goal for Manchester United. What do you think? Should Manchester United stick with De Gea or look for a new goalkeeper? Let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more football news.